All right, guys, so today is Monday the 20th, a day after the marathon, and as you guys saw in the vlogs before it is, my sister ran it, she completed it, and it was great. But today, reality hits, I have a test for anatomy, and I didn't prepare enough or correctly for it, so I'm feeling nervous and hugely, hugely disappointed in myself. But the way I'm looking at it, okay, it's one test, Get it together, let's get to it the next time. Cause I honestly know, I know I'm not gonna do any good in that test. It doesn't matter if I cram, uh, study right now, and it's not gonna happen. But guys, right now, as of this moment, I'm a little behind on the vlogs. I need to start editing them as soon as possible too. So, I don't know, I feel like I'm worried about different things and it kind of sucks to have this kind of mentality where I'm like, why am I still in school? And like, I should just do this. This is what I enjoy doing. But at the same time, it's like, it would be kind of stupid to just stop school right now. guys so I'm pretty sure you guys know where I'm at now um, you guys seen this scene before frame border catching a bite then gonna hit the library go over some notes see what the best I can make out of this um, mess up that I've done to myself with this anatomy test but for now I just want to eat All right, guys, just got out of the lab practicum and just speechless. But um, I have to focus next time and that it will do. Alright guys, so I'm getting ready for school, taking a shower, just cut my hair and everything. And then the UPS decides to come during that time. I got my package, which is this. I wonder what it is. Well, actually I already know what it is, but you don't know what it is. So I decided to buy a new tripod. I told you guys that I wanted to buy it. I've been having a problem with my videos. At times I'm like, okay, this is a great video. It doesn't matter how still I stand. I'm like, okay, I'm catching a good video, good video, good video ends up being nasty and then post working with it on post with stabilization on final cut it it's just ugly it turns out to be all flimsy and stuff now what i usually use i'm still gonna be using this to walk around with but this thing it, it's weak it's flimsy i set it up my camera falls down and i mean this is a pretty pricey camera setup so i don't want to break it or anything but I can't rely on this anymore, at least for like long periods of time. Like that. That's pretty nice. 
it's pretty sturdy it's heavy heavier i would say it's the same as my last tripod and my last tripod didn't have a radio head which is pretty cool it's really windy at the moment i know what you guys are thinking what the hell are you doing on that rooftop again luis you've shown this exact same clip again and again but i brought my tripod I like this scene and let's see how it works something i didn't like the plate I'm gonna have to be exchanging this with the plate for the gorilla pod which kind of sucks but hey i should have thought about that it just didn't come through my head guys so i took you guys to a rooftop with the idea that i was going to talk to you guys but it's really windy and that's something i've been wanting to fix for my sound i've been trying to get a dead cat but not yet but anyways that's not the point of this i was going to talk to you guys about school i thought it was the perfect place like i told you guys last time it's a place i feel like i can talk to you guys and not get bugged by anybody not get jittery because people are passing by but here i am better sound that's what matters now uh, school has been in my head lately. Uh, a few vlogs ago, I told you guys that I was focused and ready to take on the semester and everything started off great. My first tests, A's and B's for the two hardest classes that I have. Now, second test uh, is coming and yet one of the second tests I felt miserably. Uh, and it's just that I feel my focus levels falling down uh, I just, and I feel like I don't want to help myself I feel falling behind and I don't want to help myself up majority of the time I find myself thinking about Gary Vaynerchuk I know like what the hell this man has so much of an influence in your life kind of does he's a really inspiring human being but I remember him because he talks about falling in love with the process as you go towards your goal so he cares more about the process than he cares about the end goal and that's a magnificent way to look at it it's if you have no passion for what you're doing you're not gonna succeed and that's how I feel at the moment I feel like two years ago I came in and I was getting uh, honors uh, honors for the school because I had so much good grades and um, now I'm just falling behind and not wanting to help myself up which brings me to this uh, at the moment I'm enjoying this I enjoy carrying my camera I enjoy carrying this equipment that I just bought and, and just recording and then taking it home editing it uh, putting it together that whole entire process I have fun I relax during it and, and it's just something that I really really enjoy at the moment and, and it's something that I've been wanting to do since I was 18. I, I don't know if I've mentioned it before in a vlog, but when I was 18, I wanted to go to LA Film School here in, in Hollywood. And it never happened for various reasons, but now I find myself doing this and, and being in love with it. And it's something that, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. I'm just truly enjoying it. And I've spoken to people like, what do I do? I find myself being distracted in class, looking at the gear that I want to get or learning how to edit video much better. And that's not good. It's not good because I'm going to class, not paying attention. I'm not learning anything. I'm just learning about this. And, and it's great for me, but at the same time, it stresses me out because I care about school. Uh, I told my mom it's not that one is more important than the other, it's just one that one interests me way more than the other. My sister tells me to plan things out, schedule times where I would be recording for my vlog and schedule times where I'll be studying, but it, the same thing happens. I'm in the library, ready to start doing my homework, ready to start studying, and I, I'm like one video away from just learning how to use Adobe Premiere much better or learning the basics of Adobe Premiere. And that's pretty much what um, bugs me. All 
Alright, so my video camera died as I was recording this clip here or the clip that you just saw within this video and it sucks because it killed my mentality but uh, or my train of thought and well as I was saying uh, school is being a subject of stress and it's not even the workload that is being stressful it's just the fact that I can't focus I seem to have no interest in it at the moment and I really have to push myself to get the work done to pay attention in class or to even you know study the one thing that's really hard is that focusing coming into focus gaining interest within the classes I'm taking one of the classes that I thought was going to be the most interesting of them all, and it's anatomy. And at the same time, I get there, I write down the notes as he's speaking, and at the same time, I'm online reading articles about how to edit videos much better. This here, guys, this this thing that I'm working on, uh, creating videos, editing videos, it's really becoming a fun thing. It's becoming the thing that I think about the most throughout my day. and. It's something that I've been wanting to do for a long time. Not creating a YouTube channel, but filming. The, the art of filming and recording movies was always in my mind, even after high school. I've always wanted to tell stories in video format. And I wanted to go to LA Film School, as I mentioned earlier. Um, but it was too expensive, and there was no way I could have gone to that school. But here, now, I am on my own wondering and learning on my own um, and it's really fun truly interesting to be learning the craft on my own and there's nothing that's going to beat that right now i find an excitement in this right now like i did two years ago when i was going to school thinking that i was going to meet people to socialize with because at the time i was working in an environment where I work with nothing but older people, way older people, uh, people with mentalities that weren't the same as mine. And going to school, I met younger, uh, even older, but people that I could socialize with and talk to and gain um, friendships with. Now, at that moment, it was exciting. I was acing and getting great grades for every class. And now, uh, a couple semesters down, I'm just not interested. I'm not gonna quit school. I'm not, I'm just gonna continue pushing myself. I feel like I'm too deep to stop. Uh, I have to go deep inside and finish. I have to finish this thing. At least this part of it. Whether I transfer or not, we'll see later on. But guys, that's pretty much all I have to share. Um, I hate to end the video in a negative way, negative mentality, negative train of thought, but some days are just gonna be like this. Some days are gonna be heavy on me and my mentality is gonna be completely different than when it, how it usually is. And if you guys like the video, hit the thumbs up. If you guys have some comments that may help me out, Put them down below. Remember to activate the little bell so you get notified when new videos are posted for this channel, which will be more often now. But until next time.